Meet Connor. As a young child, Connor was as normal as any other kid growing up. He enjoyed various activities, such as skinny dipping, looking like a complete duster, and washing his dog, Rachel. Rachel was a very important figure in Connor's early life until a very tragic event involving a goat with large horns ended Rachel's career as a dog. This sent Connor into a downward spiral that he would never be able to overcome. He was getting involved with the wrong crowd and making horrible decisions that caused Connor to evolve into the creature now known as Rivsy. Rivsy is a loose cannon that does what he wants when he wants. He is known as one of the biggest drug addicts in the whole city. I recently interviewed Rivsy about his drug addiction and his future plans in life. So, Connor, are you a coke addict? No. Well, no, no, I don't do coke. Sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> just, just sometimes? Only at meals. So, how much approximately, if it's an approximate, do you spend on cocaine in one month? Hey! Yeah? How much do you spend on cocaine in one month? Where is someone supplying you the money, or do you just like do you have a job? I don't know, man. Where does Rivsy get the money for his hobby? A used guitar can sell for over five hundred dollars, and when you take the five finger discount into account, that is pure profit. Hey, you two, wanna buy a guitar? Welcome. Picked that thing up last week. Don't like it. It's now you. Ribsy's favorite place in the world is a place he calls the Zone, where he hallucinates about a completely different world full of trippy creatures. But the Zone can only be achieved after years of drug use that decay the very fragments of the mind. What's this zone feel like? It feels like the zone, man. This, can you describe this zone? I wanna fucking hit everything, but it, like, it's, 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 it's fucking awesome! Wow. Yeah, man. And are you like this all the time? Oh, yeah, man. Yeah? Is, I'm in the zone all the time. You come to school in the zone? Yeah, man. I am the zone. Do you sleep in the zone? No, man. No? I am the zone. You are the, the zone? The zone sleeps in me. That's deep. Oh, yeah. It's crazy, man. Wow. Yeah. What about, like, like, are you scared to fail school, or? You know, another one? That's fine. school right now. Oh man. This is the zone. This is the zone. Yeah man. It's the zone. This is the zone man. I had the privilege of meeting Connor's friend Roger, who at first I thought was just a hallucination, but I was pleasantly surprised at how sane he was. Okay. Um so who are you? Who? You my friends call me Roger. Okay, um... How do you know Connor? That guy buys, that guy buys tons of dope off me. Just dope? Oh, a lot of coke, too. Really? 
Is he like your main client or just Who? like occasional? Who? Connor. Who's that? Oh, that guy. He's a freak. How like how often does he buy drugs off you? Every day. So you admit that you're a drug dealer? No. I just sell drugs. So you are a drug dealer then? Yeah. So how did you meet Connor? I sat down and had a nice little chat with one of Connor's fellow classmates, Aaron, and asked him about his thoughts about Ribsy. So what are your thoughts on Connor? Uh, he's a really messed up fellow. Uh, like, he always comes to class big and he's fine. Does he ever, like, because I've had, I've got footage of him, like, rolling joints in class. Do you ever see that or anything? Oh, yeah, I guess I would have, but... Like, is that just normal to people? He just does yeah, that? Everyone's always, just used to it? Yeah, he always does that. <laughs> So, um, what kind of people does Connor hang around with? Uh, it's usually like the shady or sketchy type of people, like, the people you wouldn't want to get involved with. Like, do they all, like, do, do all of them do the same kind of thing as Connor? Probably. Uh, um, has Connor done anything personally to you that, you know? Like, yeah, he has. He stole my bike. Can you describe this bike? It's like a yellow bracelet. On top of his drug addiction, an illegal source of income, Ribsy likes to pull cruel pranks to keep himself entertained when he has some free time. But usually he feels too bad about it, so he stops the prank before any harm is done. <laughs> 